Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome, welcome, welcome. And if you are not new, thank you for coming back to my channel. Before we get started, I just want to say thank you again because I have been getting more subscribers and um, more comments and um, I can see that you guys are actually liking my videos now. So with that being said, um, I know I haven't posted in a while, but your girl has been busy with work, school, and just life. So I'm going to try my best, and I feel like I say this all the time, but this time I am going to be very um, disciplined, and consistency is key, so I'm going to try to film every Saturday for you guys to post at least once a week. So let's get started. Now for rambling, but I just wanted to say thank you. Um, my lips are chapped, like really chapped. I had aqua for somewhere. There we go. I don't know if the quality is good. I really tried a couple of times to come up with a better quality, but I'm trying to use natural lighting. I'm trying to use natural lighting, so hopefully you guys can see me well. Is that better? I changed the settings a little bit and I moved, as you guys can see, the angle or the backdrop, the background, it's a little bit different. I have been working on um, my vanity, so I'm using that as the background for the first time today filming and I don't know, I, let me know if you guys like it. Um, just trying different things, so this video is probably going to be all over the place. Let me get started. Um, my hair is in so much need of a curly cut. I'm getting a curly cut actually next weekend. <sighs> I can't wait for it because I just feel that my hair doesn't even curl the same anymore. And that's why I wanted to film this video because these two products that I have been religiously using. Um, I don't know, I feel like they give me some curls and definition. I don't know because I'm not getting any um, at all. And I know it's because I need a curly cut. So I have been getting a lot of new tools and I can't wait to show you guys what I have been doing because I feel like I have been updating Instagram but not YouTube and that's going to change like I said. So I have been using this brush which I'm pretty sure you guys have seen it um, on social media. So I got it from a local salon called Me, Salon Me. And this stuff, you guys, like this brush detangles your hair like crazy. Like I cannot tell you how I don't even know how to describe this brush. It's just amazing. It detangles like it goes through every it goes through every strand and just like gets rid of all the nuts. So the product that I'm gonna be using, one of the products that I'm using today is both of both of them are from the main choice is the Tropical Moringa. I think that's how you pronounce it, Tropical Moringa. And this is how this bat boy looks like. It's almost gone, but I have another bottle because I like it so much. Um, and I'm very generous. You guys know the drill. I use a lot of product. Um, well, not a lot, enough to coat every strand that there is and that I have. This product, honestly, you guys, I feel like I wouldn't use it, and that's why I never used it before because I do have, I've had it for a while, but I never really liked it because in my opinion, I feel like you have to use it combined with this product. Sorry, it's all over. It's dirty because my fingerprints are all over it. Like I said, about the main choice is this, oh wait. Both are Tropical Moringa. This is a sealing cream, I'm sorry. And this one is a pearly braid out glaze. Oh my gosh. This product is a little bit weird. It's very blue. And it's kind of like a slime. Just a little bit 
like stickier and very blue so I'm not a big fan of that but it is amazing on my hair so I have been using it like crazy and don't use a lot of it I have hair all over my hands don't use a lot of it because then your hair is gonna wear down and your curls are not gonna be bouncy but it will define every strand y'all like when I tell you strands I mean like every single piece of hair on your head boo-boo so I do try to focus on my scalp too because I want every part of my hair to be defined like every strand so you guys already can see the curls like what this is crazy wait until my hair dries my curls are gonna be popping um, I'm doing this on camera like like I'm doing it now like separating my hair in small sections because I want you guys to see how my hair looks like um, and like what I do but to be honest I just have to make sure to be honest I always find myself doing my hair in the bathroom lately that's what I've been doing because guys when I tell you that life is hard and I have been busy like I'm not kidding grad school is no joke a full-time job it's not a joke and trying to be healthy you know work out and just have a life it's not a joke so I find myself lately just doing my hair in the bathroom and then I I have noticed that when my hair is soaked like soaked that's when it comes out the best so I have been applying these two products in the shower like right after I wash my hair my hair is like still dripping and I just find myself doing that lately and my curls are amazing I'm just saying that I find that my curls are not defined like getting as defined and bouncy as before and it's because I need to cut my I need to I need a trim I need a trim and then a TLC like that's what I'm doing next weekend it's gonna be my first curly cut ever and I'll vlog it for you guys I'm gonna vlog that so that's gonna be next Saturday so that's gonna be the second video and then we can just you know continue with the routine and keep on going and be consistent because I see you guys you guys have been liking my videos and all of you guys that are new welcome comment let me know what you guys want to see and thank you for you know being part of my virtual friends and virtual curl friends oh my god I'm loving my hair right now I wanted to show you if you're not new to my channel then you already know I did cut my hair well just like this part in the summer kind of like getting bangs I mean that's what I call the video but I don't know if I really did a good job it was my first time cutting some part of my hair on my own and look at how long it is and it's November pretty much like 
What? This is crazy. Crazy. So for the front, I'm gonna do the same thing. Um, just wet it completely. Like, I can add more water. I just try to, again, I do this in the bathroom, so I'm just trying to spray as much water as I can before I get tired, because I don't know, I get tired from spraying too much water. It's time consuming. So, I'm just going to do the same thing, brush my hair from the bottom to the top. Yarn up the drill. See how smooth this brush just goes through? Like, what the heck? This is crazy. And same thing, working my way from the bottom to the, not from the top to the bottom when I apply the gel. And then I'm just gonna separate my, this part right here and bring some to the back and I apply more gel or glaze. Cause it's called a glaze. And I'm going to use this brush to just brush it and help the product um, distribute better. Same thing in the front. Same thing on this side. I think I applied too much here because I can, I can already feel it getting a little bit like stiff. That's what I always fear. But for the front, y'all. We gotta apply it a little bit more because we gotta control those edges as much as possible. And then I just like do this. I don't know why. Like I, like if I was putting a dip conditioner in my hair, that's like the last thing that I do. And then just um let my hair do its own thing, like this. And that's about it. I'll see you guys in a little bit. My hair is currently 90% dry. Um, I started filming the video around 5.15 or 5 o'clock, 5.15 and it's currently 12.15. So seven hours went by and my hair is, like I said, like 90% dry. Just the roots need to be dry a little bit more. Um, what I use after is this intense hydration oil. Um, and I just use one pump, but I'm gonna use one and a half today. And I just like warm it up a little bit with my palms. Start at the bottom, move my way through the top. So it's kind of like separating the curls a little bit and then locking in those curls and then just giving more volume to my hair so pretty much that's all I'm doing and then that's it this is how I do my hair whenever I'm in a rush which is almost all the time um and yeah that's about it my lips are chapped again winter time good 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 well this is the end of the video i hope you guys liked this video i hope you guys learned some tricks and tips um, again, I do this in the bathroom. I apply the products in the bathroom and then I let it air dry for like 30 minutes and then I diffuse sometimes. Most of the time, I just let my hair air dry and I apply the oil at the end so I can just lock in those curls and separate the curls a little bit more and just give my hair more volume like I just did now. Um, 
and yeah that's about it so um that's this is the end of the video i hope you guys liked this video and if you guys did um keep leaving comments down below let me know what else you guys would like to see in my channel I'll try my best actually no next week we are going vlogging so stay tuned for my first curly cut next week thank you for watching you guys will see me in my next video bye guys